You can as well. Please. We're making movies, but quiet on the set. I have to go. You're already on. Oh, I'll get you to go. <laughs> All right. So you've made an extension lead. There, there, there is our extension lead. So effectively, you've joined the first wire to this pin. What you would expect is that will be, it's made of copper wire, it's been terminated properly because you've twisted it and folded it over, you've put it underneath the screws, you would have pulled on it to make sure that it's not going to fall out. It's inside the clamps inside here, it's not been pulled out as well. The visual check did is in the right place. The other visual check you did unknowingly was it's the right size cable to do the job. The cable is the right cable for the environment. It's not particularly freezing cold. There's not a lot of chemicals. There's not really a lot of heat. It's the cable we give you. Um, right, so you would expect that that from this point here to this point here would be low resistance. So you need a multimeter that can read low resistance down to the, um, the 1 and 2 ohm scale and less. So you select on the ohm scale, to make sure it's plugged into the common and the ohms, join the ends of the probes together, join the ends of the probes together with this particular meter, so zeroing the meter, so I can see that it's 0 0.3, so I need to take my measurements and subtract 0 0.3, all with this meter here, push the REL button, and it's already on, that's why, so we're coming down to zero, so I've zeroed the meter, so now what I need to do is measure from that point there and that point there what I expect it will be very low ohms because it's a piece of copper wire I expect it to be zero or very very close to it the lowest it's allowed to be is one ohm shall not exceed one ohm is the correct expression that's the test we're going to do now so there we are onto the bench <laughs> so one probe in there I'm expecting zero ohms by doing this one here, hold it good and tight. Point two. Pass easily. So the next test you have to do is up here again, from phase to phase and neutral to neutral. So that's the continuity tests. Go and do those.